morning guys um today's a sunday i woke up a few so i put you here i woke up a few as a no i probably like woke up an hour ago and you know what I told myself that I was going to start this vlog today. So I'm starting the vlog. Okay, I look a little mess. I look like a little mess. But let's start with this. Hi guys. My name is Sunshine Machika. But I'm known by Sunshine and in this channel. And if you're new, do not forget to like, subscribe because it's free. And comment if you have anything to say. And please share the video when you get the time. And it Dropping on the beat. The beat. Like them, they me out and then they ghost. Apply my lips because I feel like they're so dry. I said, This is, I don't think it's something that I should be because it's very shiny. But anyway, it's something to aid. Yesterday, I like yesterday before I slept, I heard very very sad news about someone i knew and um you know what i was just in disbelief until i saw those news on facebook myself and you know what me i don't know what to say honestly but <clears throat> one thing for me is guys check up on the people you know always do no matter what whether you and those people don't talk anymore it's fine i'm gonna sit down i'm gonna have to put you guys in the tripod but i was saying guys whether you don't talk with those people, do not mind that they it's not the whether you don't talk to some people anymore it's fine guys let's check up on each other our youth is going through a lot and we don't see it you know like i feel like as people we've gotten to a point where we've made it normal talking about or like just creating drama on some things that i'm not okay i'm not. you know what you could never know whether that person is telling the truth or not but all i can say is at this moment i haven't talked to that person in a minute and right now at this moment all i ask myself is if it was possible for me to ask that person why they did what they did you know because as much as maybe i knew one two three but i never thought they are capable of doing what they did and for me that is the most painful thing that there's people out there who suffer in silence to a point where they think taking their life is the last resort you know so if you feel like you are a person that can get through someone talk to those people you know like check up on people guys like peter fights are not necessary indo is not necessary as it's necessary you know so yeah i just wanted to say that but yesterday i told myself that i'm gonna go to church today and after i actually saw the truth of the news i was like starting to drag that point but i was like you know what i'm gonna go to church so welcome to the vlog and uh, yeah i don't know where it's gonna take us but it's starting today which is a sunday and we are going to church so happy sunday to everyone out there and let's go to church and praise the lord you know and we'll come back and you know what this news is actually very disturbing for me Kodo. 
I'll see what you do with the news that I have. I will reach out to where I can reach out in the sense of the people that I know from their family and send my condolences. That's I think that's all I can give. It's so painful to experience death, guys. Um I've never talked about um my uh father's death because he passed on january was it no december but we laid him to rest like january so on the 4th of jan so i know you guys saw that on my last december vlog i think and you know what one thing i can say is once you experience death in the family you start seeing life differently or i could say for me i started seeing life very very differently i started getting anxious a lot about people around me maybe my mom could could contest to this but literally every time i call my mom and i don't get her on the phone i freak the hell out i would call everyone i think of so that i can be able to know where is she and is she okay like everything around me i get scared very quickly i like i start realizing how short life is and to be here now again experiencing a dead of someone that i knew it is really painful you know because right now i'm sitting here in a sense of it never gets old i'm telling you it could it, it never gets old you always will have a question after you hear such news, you know? You will always blame yourself somehow with other things, maybe. You will always wonder if 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 I did this, what, what could have happened? But I remember I once saw, so I don't remember if it was a quote or I heard it somewhere that it is, it is not a correct way of mourning people by keep on like staying in pain you know always try and remember them with love and happiness because that's sometimes that's what the people need you know the people that have passed on um that's what they need i don't know if that makes sense because i also do not know if i believe that after you've passed on you know what it's another conversation that i do not want to get into but that's one thing that i told myself that you know what i dwelled so much into a situation because i was afraid that if i step out of that situation it will be insensitive it will feel like i am moving on and I'm, I'm being happy without those people and i know that those people are no more i went through that with a friend of mine that passed on a few years ago she was literally my age when she was very sick i went through that with my um stepdad and i don't know i don't think i am gonna go through that now but what i know is this is a very painful thing that just happened so i'm gonna end this now here because i've been talking for eight minutes but i feel like i needed to offload somewhere and you guys are always the people i feel safe talking to so let's get into the vlog and enjoy it well yeah Welcome back to another vlog. So, it's a graduation prep vlog. We're graduating child. I don't know how to scream because <laughs> I don't know how to fake things. But I am excited nonetheless. So, um, I have to go. The wind. Guys, Pretoria is insane. I'm going to close this. That's my friend. I haven't even left. And I said to her, I was going to leave at that moment. Where the hell is that for? 
She's gonna watch this vlog and she's gonna kill me. Okay. Nila, I from shed news. Oopy. Oh, sure. Not my lying ass. But anyway, welcome to the vlog. Uh, this vlog is gonna take place in. In a lot, in, in, in how many days? I don't know, two to three weeks? I don't know. But it's starting here. Let's go fetch my friend. We're gonna go to a house of graduation in. House of graduation in Hatfield to go buy my belt. Oh, we still have it here. So, we'll talk. Subscribe! It's free. When was it, Will? Was it last year? Last year, yeah. Uh -oh, last of last year. Ah. Doc, I started dating with Akio last of last year. Exactly. At the beginning. At the beginning. Oh, yeah. Hey, <laughs> guys, it's the been beginning. that long. So we are here at House of Graduates hmm. to buy the stuff. Hello. Hi. How are you? Okay. Thing, okay? Mm -hmm. Are we registering? Can you wait on your hair? Get correct. Correct. Hey. Good. No. Uh -uh. Correct and nothing. Nothing. Thank you. I should. Woo! Can I buy a cup of coffee? Come Apparently we couldn't take it with us. You're gonna get it at the graduation hall, which I don't think it makes sense because I bought that belt. I'm not hiring it. But okay, I'll show you the belt here. Now we are going to Maravastat to try to go and scout out my outfits because guys, I saw things at Zara and I was like, I'm not about to spend three thousand for Indes or Indes. I got two hours. That could never be my life. So yeah, we're going to Marabastad right now. Hi guys, so, <clears throat> you know what? Let me close this one before. So. It's quite cold, it's quite cold. And I said this when I started the vlog and I'm saying it again, it's really cold. So the thing is, I was supposed to um, be having a whole lot of different weekend my cousin was supposed to come here for her birthday so i thought you know what i was just gonna start the vlog and continue the vlog like yesterday but that happened i actually don't want to talk about it it's kind of annoying me but um i went to maravastad that's in another vlog because i'm shooting two vlogs like at the same time i just wanted to show you guys this because i'm gonna i want to do them now i want to try them out I bought stick on nails and whatever style they were for this weekend when my cousin was coming. I got lashes also. Things are quite affordable there, hey. But whatever style is actually expensive, guys. I see you like no I got masks. Literally a day before they announced that we don't have to wear masks anymore. But with this whole what what pox, I don't even want to talk about it. But I researched about it the other time and i'm just con gonna continue wearing my mask that is just my opinion and also this apparently is the glue for the nails so i'm gonna use this i'm gonna insert this nails now and i'll show you guys when i'm done so today is a saturday it's kind of late now it's like afternoon like it's 
two what's four and i just finished bathing i'm gonna chill in bed because yeah the weather is crazy and i'm gonna do my nails and then i'll show you guys and then hi guys um so today is a tuesday and i'm walking to bossman to get my clothes tailored have as my suit i'm going to get tailored at this other place where my boyfriend tailors his jeans i hope you guys can hear me because we have and sorry with the light but we have established that i am always going to be wearing my mask because as in i say next but yeah this is the update we're going to tailor the week the suit just like a good ninja and yeah win and my the shoulders of the suit and then yeah that's it i hope you guys enjoy this vlog because nowadays i seem to be vlogging like when there's something happening only so yeah let's keep on moving hi guys um the last time we talked it was tuesday now it's thursday and you know what i'm kind of still wearing the same because that's just immense i'm kind of still wearing like the same things because i'm going home this weekend and when i get back um i'm gonna come back closer to graduation and i'll be just like running around like from the fifth when i get back till the seventh and on the eighth we're catching flights we're catching flights we catch your flights. <laughs> ah, it's gonna be my first time catching a flight, but we catch your flights. We're gonna see my baby. Okay, so first time I talk about it, but we'll talk about it. So, so come on, I see you again one man. So right now I'm going to the complex tram shed here, and then I'm going to fetch my um suit. Remember, guys, that I went to get it tailored. It cost me two hundred and fifty. I am bleeding. I've never spent so much money. Right now, it's difficult for me to even spend 100 rand. But I told you guys that I was gonna put those stick ons. I did. I don't know. People say they look nice. I don't know. I don't know. I just put them on because I just wanna get used to the length of nails because you guys know that I never really have nails ever. So I wanna get used to the nails so that when I do my nails for the graduation, because I know I'm gonna have them longer. I know how to do things and I should know whether I'm comfortable with this letter. So this ones are gonna I'm gonna take them out very soon. But now we are leaving. Let's not forget my mask. I'm going to take out the money. This and then we are going to fetch my suit. That's the agenda of today. And then we'll see you the outer. Friday. I remember I told you guys that I was going home, but now I have to leave it. Hello. Is that thing joining? Ah. Is it your channel? No. Yeah, go again. Guys, I was still saying that. I was, I was actually saying that. The delivery guy is here he just called me to come pick up my hair i'm so glad that the hair has arrived let me put you here i was still in bed like guys where she's uh i don't know what time is it it's something like it, i think it's 11 or something now i'm waiting for i'm waiting for hot water i'm eating here don't mind that broom like do not mind anything that's happening in this room because i can have cat because i feel like i look like a monkey now i guess it guys it is what it is you guys know here good hairs and life is the way it is but anyway here's the plastic i got my hair from dulcy looks i was starting to panic because i'm going home but to be quite honest 
the hair did take 10 days to be done and then the next day it got shipped so that's fine Ooh, my first hair i knew guys in life okay this is not my first hair i once bought hair i don't know if guys i ever showed you back 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 then i think two years ago in my vlogs but ha huh, thank you for your pictures Yes, it's fine. Why does hair take 10 days to be sewn when I'm gonna see this? Whatever this is here. So this is a three part week. So I guess you can part it anyway. And it's a 14 inch, is it? I think yeah, 14 inch. Um this is how it looks like inside. Let's see, you go to young lehang. it's pretty actually let me not complain why am i being a bitch because it's not like i know anything about hair anyway but this is the hair a great friend of mine is gonna install the hair for me she's like a sister actually because she's kind of a little bit older than me she's gonna install the hair for me there's nothing much to do with the installation i just think like she'll just help me like make it look nicer because i've never had hair anyway so she'll just help me make it look nicer began i am um, what is this oh yeah i almost said hi bo okay let's rewear this guys i don't know how to behave with hair like i've never had hair I have hair that I ruined, so it's just sitting there waiting. Also, the thing is this long, and the hair is 16 inch, and it's pretty. I will not lie, I like the hair. I like the hair. This will be my stable wig, and then I'll buy more hair. My mom bought me this hair. I'm grateful for that. Even though she does not understand why we have to wear people's apparently she says it's people's dead hair and she does not understand why we have to wear people's dead hair in this like the the actual price of the hair because i bought this 1.650 and i told her that there's actually a certain somebody that sells hair for 24k so what do you mean she, she was like i love that woman she was literally like Who's gonna see the hair with his 24,000? And I was like, please preach, preach to the choir because I hear you. But I love the hair, guys. This is already four minutes. I'm gonna cut it now because you know what? We're working in space. Here's the hair, here's the length. Um, I'm happy. I'm happy. It's your life. Huh? I never really liked the way you dressed. I guess I thought your style might grow on me You never really honest made me guess And now I want you far from close to me You don't have the time for me I Hey guys, so Tomorrow's graduation day, I'm so tired um, I'm sure you guys can see that um, The scenery is different I'm tired because I literally moved I literally moved uh yesterday when i got back i moved there's a, a little clip of me doing my nails but i did my nails yesterday love them siyama did my nails she's original from rustenberg so if you are from rustenberg i'll leave her numbers and i'll ask her if can i leave her numbers in the description box and then i'll leave her numbers those are my nails yeah i did my nails yesterday um i'm gonna do my hair like around a first four to towards five ish i'm gonna do my hair right now i'm gonna eat i haven't eaten because i literally just moved i'll show you guys how this room looks like in another vlog i literally just moved 
so i haven't eaten and i went to clicks to get my uh prevention because i changed preventions i'm taking the pill now so i want to click to get that and then i'm gonna eat now and then we're gonna start ironing my suit and then also my uh graduation gown let me show you guys so we have like this room is darker than my room like that other one so don't mind this those things are going home here's my graduation gown i hang it there so here my mom's but i'm gonna use it so i have to wipe it she said that i must wipe it i shouldn't iron it because it'll t it'll make it shiny so i have to wipe it and then iron my my suit and then that's it for the day tomorrow it's a new day it's a new vlog it's graduation day so yeah guys let me eat and then we will do what we need to do morning guys so um it's five o'clock right now and i just wanted to show you the suit that we ironed it yesterday i couldn't show you it was quite late and there's also the graduation card i told you that i was gonna um wipe it it's wiped back in the cover suit and ready have the time to please you a pack